What's going on people? Muffin Dog Man here and today we are reviewing this. This is the House of Marley No Bounds Portable Bluetooth Speaker. Coming in around £35, we're going to find out whether this is worth your money. Alright, so let's have a quick look at the packaging of the product. So, this can be bought for about £35, give or take depending on where you get it from, but that seems to be the average price around the board. So first things first, we have a Rewind Fabric, so that's pretty nice, it's pretty much what you see on a lot of their products, especially some of their older ones. Uh, 10 hour battery life, so pretty solid on that. Uh, IPS 67, so water, water and dust is, uh, proof. As they put on there, let's check out the back. It says the same thing, but how they got the little Bob Marley logo right there. And that, I actually like the packaging of this. This is really, really nice. There we have the speaker. It comes in a few different colors, so I might put that up on the screen just to show you what other colors it comes in. But let's take this out. Let me pause you right there. So there's another feature that I forgot to mention, uh, and that was wireless dual speaker pairing, which basically allows you to pair two of these devices, so two of these um, no bound speakers together, and be able to kind of like maximize the sound of it and have them, you know, have them in two locations, let's say, if you're at the park, for instance, and you have two of these, you're in a big group, put one on one side, put one on the other side, and be able to get that kind of like heavier stereo sound which is a nice feature to have uh, I thought I'd just quickly mention that because that is a selling feature of the speaker why you would buy two I don't know if it's really worth that but I'll let you know anyway back to the video okay so we first of all we have the little hook so you can hook this on a pocket wherever you want oh this is the speaker right there. Really nice, but let's look at the accessories. Not much in the way. Okay, so here is what we get. We get the little the little hook. You can hook this on pretty much anything. And you, you see this quite a lot on a lot of their speakers. Pretty nice. Uh, you get a pretty nice cable, as you always do. Nice braided cable. It's a micro USB. One day I'm hoping they actually go towards the Type-C route because, you know, Type-C just be way better than Micro. I cannot stress that enough and it doesn't cost that much to pull it on. From what I've heard, it only costs about 10p extra just to add uh, to swap it from a Micro to a Type-C, but you know, hey her. This is somewhat of a decently old product. It's not super old, but old enough. And this is the speaker itself. So you've got the, so where you can hook this. Nice little logo. Really nice fabric at the bottom. Rubberized, so it's pretty much stays still. Let's turn this, but let's have a look at the arrow quickly. So I guess this is the charging port. Yeah, so you've got a, a 3.5 millimeter head jack port there, an aux charging cable, Bluetooth pair button, on button, uh, and volume down, volume up, play pause. So pretty simple, pretty, pretty there. Nice logo at the top there. Let's turn this bad boy on. Yep, still got the exact same sound. Let me grab a phone. So I'm gonna quickly take you through the setup process as well. Like any Bluetooth speaker, it is pretty much connects the same way. So what I'm gonna do, I've got my laptop here because my other phone is dead and out of battery. So we turn this on. You wanna press the Bluetooth button. Got a little indicator right there, blue, red. So we know that's in para mode. So on my laptop, we're just gonna to go to Bluetooth and then wait for this to pop up. There we go, no bounds, BLE. There's two actually coming up. I think this is what I need to do, the audio. There we go. Just like that, we heard a doo. Ooh. 
and we're gonna quickly just go on a uh, YouTube video right now. Okay, so I've got a base, ultra base test going on now. Let's actually test out the base of this speaker. Change locations just to try and get the best out of the speaker. Gone out, sort and gone outdoors, so we're not going to get so much echo. Uh, so I've got right now a ultra deep bass test, just to test out the uh, the bass on the speaker itself. We're going to turn, we're going to crank this right up, and see how we do from there. It's, it, it goes so loud that it moves in the table, which for something so small, actually pretty impressive, you know? Like when it comes down to it, sound quality, really clean, clear. Um, yeah, man, like I can't even, I'm, I'm pretty astounded, something so small compared to the older one that they used to have. Um, I can't, I think that was the House of Marley's Charm which was a really good speaker, it looked really nice, but they've definitely come a long way with their sound. So, god damn, I might do like a, a one month review afterwards just to see how I progressed with this speaker. And you know, I'm gonna take it out tonight to a friend's barbecue. Might show you guys a bit more of the sound and how it goes from there. But for now, peace. Oh, by the way, I might also do a another one. So there's another Marley speaker I'm pretty interested in. I think it was the House of Marley No Bound Sport, which is a bigger speaker. I think that normally retails between around eight pounds. So I might go for that. Considering this is a thirty-five pound speaker, it's you know for the value. If you want to just take it to the beach, take it out with you, ride it with your bike, really show people what you're about. Take it to the park, man. It's a really good small speaker to take with you. I highly recommend it um so but if you're not subscribed to subscribe because again we all be getting that house of marley bound sport speaker and we're going to test that out and see what that's like i'm going to put both of these head to head as well and see if there's actually if it warrants the price difference if you should go for this or should you go for that if you're looking for a bit more power but anyway people i'm out peace